Welcome back from my workout guys. Um, today is going to be a bar workout. So you need some kind of handle, like a broomstick handle. I just unscrewed that one. Um, or a dowel rod. If you have a dowel rod, um, just a piece of wood, um, a mop handle, or a yardstick, anything like that will work great. Um, if you don't have it, again, it's okay. You, didn't absolutely, you don't absolutely have to have them. Um, totally up to you guys which one you guys want to use. Uh, we have, I'm doing, we got like about a 40 minute workout, we'll just be shy of 40 minutes. And we're doing two rounds this time. In the two rounds we have six different moves. We're going 50 seconds a piece and 10 seconds rest, so about a minute rest in between all that. Um, that's kind of the overview. Go grab your, your uh, yardstick or whatever handle you may be using. And we're gonna start warming up. We're going our hands wide, we're going to reach it down Reaching across to the opposite hand to opposite toe. Getting a good stretch on the back of those legs. Hope you're all doing well. Miss seeing you guys in the classroom. Try to get a little deeper. Get those legs nice and warm. We're gonna switch it, bring the toe up to the hand. Reach those hands up and around, open up those shoulders. Squeeze in that core. We're gonna drop straight into a squat. Keeping that chest up, dropping the hips. Sinking a little lower with each squat. Driving through those heels, pressing the weight back. Hold it down in that squat. Press those hips up, take the hands down to the floor or to your shins. Roll up nice and slow. Take it over to your left side, drop to that lunge. Sinking down into it, breathe it through it. Take it to your right side. Keep that chest up, your shoulders are down. Open up that chest, go to that left side again. We're gonna turn it out. Hip flexor stretch, pressing that hip towards the floor. Drop down if you need to. Split that front leg, straight leg stretch. We're gonna rotate all the way over to our right side. Drop it down to that hip flexor. Split in the front leg. Coming back to that center, you're gonna roll up nice and slow, chin to chest. Come up tall, take that right arm across. Switch them. There's a pop. Right elbow up and over. If you're really flexible, you can reach behind and grab those fingertips together. Give me a good stretch. Switch them. Circle those arms forward. Take it back. Using the uh, the broom handle, we're gonna work our shoulders quite a bit and work on the challenge our flexibility a bit. Open up the chest, going across. All right, go grab some water. Grab your dowel, your your broomstick, your handle, your dowel, whatever it's gonna be, whatever you guys are gonna use. Um, and our first one, we're gonna grab it. You're gonna go hands all, all the way out, depending on how long your broom handle is, your stick. Um, you're gonna go to the edges, and we're gonna do a squat. When you're gonna lift up, you squat. You're gonna lift one hand up. The other side goes down. Again, you don't have to use it. You can go out without a stick if you don't have one. Same difference. 
We got six moves for our first round, 10 se or 50 seconds on, 10 seconds rest. Grab those, uh, those handles. We're going to squat first with the handle lifted. Here we go, you go up as you squat. You lift one hand up, press the other hand down. Open up that shoulder. Keep that chest back. If you're modifying, you're just not going down as deep in that squat. Still focusing on pushing the hips back and your chest is staying up. Lifting one hand, press the other hand down. 10 more seconds here. Breathing through it. Time. We're going down onto the ground. Move that one right away. We're going to do toe touches. Bar goes straight out in front of you. You're going to lift the toes straight up, trying to touch your bar. Make it as challenging as you guys want. If you see your shoulders shrugging, pull them down away from those ears. Breathing through it. If you want an added challenge, take the heels up off the ground. Try to reach those toes all the way up to those bars. Drop the hands just a little if you need. Great job guys, great job. 10 more seconds. Keeping those shoulders back and down. And time, we're coming back up. You're gonna do a reverse, whoop. We're gonna reverse lunge. You're gonna twist towards the side that's back, or the knee that's forward. So lunge it reverse, twist those arms towards the knee that's forward. Come back center. Squeeze in that core as you twist over. Try to keep those hands up, don't let them fall down. Same thing if you're not using a stick or your handle. You don't want it out, same motion. Try to take the hands a little bit wider on those bars. And time. We're going all the way down onto the ground. You're gonna keep the bar up. You're gonna do a sit up, extend through, drop back down, keeping the hands up the whole time. Try to keep your heels on the floor. If you're squeezing with that core, drive it up, lay it back one vertebrae at a time. Extend all the way through, press those hands back at the top. Breathing through it. You can bring the knees in if you need. Five more seconds. Time. All right, we're gonna alternate a single leg. So you're gonna go out, drop the bar down, come back in, switch sides. Take it out, whoop. Take it out, bring the bar down, up, meet in the middle. Try to keep that back leg straight. Putting a bend in it if you need. Working those shoulders, keep that core tight. Ten more seconds, guys. Keep going. Woo. Balance is struggling today. 
time. All right, we're going to a side plank. You're gonna go onto the elbow, take that, that bar up. You're gonna bring it down in front, back up. Going on the left side this time. Squeeze those shoulder blades together as you bring the bar up. We're gonna switch on this one. Switch sides over to the other. Using that knee if you need. Open up that chest, squeezing the shoulder blades. Pressing the hip up towards the ceiling. You got five more seconds. And time. One round or one set of that done. Got a minute break, grab some water. We're gonna roll through those six moves again. If you guys want, feel free to add some weight to your bars where you get a heavier one. You can tape something to them. Um, you have a broom handle and it's still on there. Just make sure you're switching sides so you're countering that weight. We got 30 more seconds in this rest and we're going back to those six. All right, grab your sticks, whatever you guys are using, your bars. We're gonna go back to the squat. As you're squatting down, one hand goes up, the other hand presses down. All right, we're starting in five seconds. Keeping that chest up, here we go, drop it down. Press one hand up, the other one goes down. Try to sink a little deeper in those squats. Pressing through those heels as you're coming back up. Shoulders are pressed down away from those ears. Keep going, guys. Ten more seconds here. Keep pushing it. And time. On down to the ground. You want to bring your hands in. Pretty much shoulder width apart for these toe touches. Take it up, make it challenging. Drive those toes up. Keeping those backs flat, shoulders down. Again, you can take the heel, tap out. Don't let them touch, make it a little more challenging. Whatever works for you. Great job, guys. Keep going, keep going. Try not to bring the arms down and meet your toes. Force those toes to come up and meet you. You got 10 more seconds. Shoulders are down. Keep after it, keep after it. Woo! And time. We're coming up, we're doing our reverse lunge. Or step back, twist it over towards the leg that's forward. Here we go. Twisting as far back as you can. Squeezing that core. Belly button's pulled tight to that spine. Trying to get both legs down at 90. If you're modifying, don't go down as far. Don't twist as far back. Keep challenging yourselves. Try to speed up if you can. Arms are still staying straight out.
in time. We're doing our single legs. Is that right? Nope, we're going to our sit up. Sorry. Sit up all the way on the ground. Head straight, straight up. Sit up, extend through the hole at the top. Pressing that head through. Arms never come down, keep them up. Bring those heels in if you need. Try to keep them on the floor the whole time. Twenty more. Keep pushing it, guys. Don't give in. You got six more seconds. And time. Roll up. We're doing our single legs again. So you extend. Oh, man. Balance. Extend it out. Woo. All right, we're sitting out. Drop the weight into the bar down. Come back center. Right leg has no balance today. If you can't get quite your leg all the way up, it's okay if it stays down low. As long as you keep challenging yourselves. Fifteen more seconds. Squeezing those shoulders, keep them down. Going down to the floor. Starting with our left elbow. We're going to the side plank. Take that bar up. Coming down to the floor. Bring it all the way back. Chest still stay square, try not to round the shoulders on the way down. Just that arm and that bar is coming down. Press the hip towards the ceiling, using that knee if you need to. And we're gonna switch sides. Keep going guys. Last one of this round, you got it. 10 less, 10 more seconds. Press that hip a little higher. Time, drop it down. Grab yourself some water. We made it through the first six. We're going to the next six. We're going one minute recovery. Make sure you guys are staying hydrated. Hopefully you're enjoying the bar workout or the handle workout, whatever you want to call this. Um, the next one, we have six new ones. First one is going to challenge your flexibility. So I want you to take the, the, as far out as you can on your handles or your bar. As far out as you can, we're going to do a squat where we keep our hands up above our head. Try not to slouch. You'll find yourself if you're cheating. You gotta keep your chest up, hips back. If you need to modify it a little, just drop the hands out a bit more in front of the hand, or in front of your head. Don't go down as far if you need to. It's really gonna challenge your, uh, challenge your uh, flexibility on this one. All right, here we go, bars up. You're dropping it down, keeping those hands up. Take those hands out as far as you can. You can make it a little more challenging to bring them in. If you need to, do a little sumo squat. That's okay. Make sure those toes aren't going over, those knees aren't going over your toes. Keep those bars up. I know it's tough, but you got it, you got it. Not giving in. Belly buttons pulled tight to that spine, squeezing that core. 10 more seconds. Mm. 
time. All right, next one, you're gonna do a front raise to a lat pull down. Squeeze the bar behind you, drop it back down. Here we go. Raise up, pull it down, take it back all the way in front. Squeeze those shoulder blades as you're doing that lat pull down. Again, you want your hands out towards the end of your bars. You can take the bar out if you need. Going straight up, pull down, create your own resistance. Head down if you don't have one. Fifteen more seconds, hang in there. Shoulders are staying down. Five seconds. Time. All right, this time, as you lunge, you're gonna lunge and row. Just like you're rowing a boat. See for those hands wide. Here we go. You lunge back. Just like you're rowing that boat, squeezing that core. If you don't have the stick, same motion, try to keep the hands apart from each other. Trying to get those legs at 90 degrees as you're lunging back. Keep going, guys. Shoulders should be burning. Legs are feeling it. Try not to come up too high. Alright, we're going back to, you're going to do four taps on the way down, lift up high, four taps, sit up, four twists down, keeping those shoulders back, raise it up, twist it for four down, knees are staying in this time. But still trying to keep the heels on the floor. Roll it up. Breathing through it. Try not to round those shoulders or those backs. Staying flat the whole time. Three more seconds. Time. Next one. You're going to do, we're going to work our calves a little, doing bar hops. So you're going to single leg. We're going to switch halfway. If you'd like, just take out the bar. If you're worried, you're going to fall over it. Single leg hops. If you need to modify it, you can just do cow raises. Step over and touch your wall if you need a little balance. All right, we're halfway, switch those legs. Quick hops, quick hops. And you can take out the bar if you need, or you're doing calf raises. You got 10 more seconds here. Keep going, guys. And time, last one. We're gonna take the bar, going back to our seated, take the bar underneath one leg, you're gonna switch them. <sighs> Trying to keep that top leg at a 90 degree angle. <sighs> you can drop the bottom leg if you need. <sighs> Driving that knee towards the chest, passing that bar underneath, take the ball out, or the bar out if you need. Just clap your hands underneath. Totally up to you guys. Again, take that bottom leg down if you need. You got 10 more seconds, or 50 more seconds, sorry. Keep going, keep going. Final five. Hang in there, guys. 
time. <sighs> grab those water bottles. <sighs> Forgot my logo. Grab it. Remember that. six moves and we're going to the cool down and you are finished we're starting with the hands up above our heads as we do our squats challenging that flexibility again body is feeling good nice and warm you got 10 more seconds Head back to your spots, grabbing those handles, those bars, whatever it is you're working with. Hands up above, feet wide, here we go, drop it down. Try to get deep in that squat. Hands are staying up. Try to keep that bar back behind the head if you can. Do a little sumo squat if you need to. Not holding that breath. Awesome job, guys. Seat down lower. Press through those heels to get back up. Five more seconds. And time. We're going to that front raise. To the, uh, the lap pull down, press it back up. Here we go, raise it up, pull it down, back out. Creating your own resistance on the way down. Squeeze those blades together. Keeping the shoulders down as you raise up. Controlling the motion the whole time. Don't rush it. No hurry here. Three more seconds. One more. Time. All right, we're going to our lunges with the row. So as you lunge back, you like you. Twist towards the knees as forward, bring it back up. Rowing your boat down the, the river. Getting ready for some summer paddle boarding. Squeezing that core as you drop over. If you want to add a challenge, you can do split squats. Same motion. If you're modifying, you're not going as deep, not twisting back as far. You hit play to get better, keep challenging yourselves. 10 more seconds here. Keep going, keep going, guys. Time. Down to the ground. We're doing our four twists. Do a sit up, take the bar out if you need, four twists down, roll it up. Keeping those knees in, breathing through it. Keep those arms out the whole time. You got 15 more seconds here. Keep going guys, keep going. Challenging yourselves, three more seconds. 
time. Dropping that bar down. We got single leg hops. Starting with our right leg. Working those calves. Here we go, back and forth. Again, you can take the hop, the bar out. This hop side to side. Or you do normal cow raises. If you need a little support, hang on to that wall. And we're switching legs. Keep going, guys. You got 10 more on this one. Only one more move after this. And time. We're doing our legs. Pass underneath of the bar. See, so sit. Drive that left knee in first. Pass that bar underneath. Trying to get whoop, that top leg to 90 as it pulls in towards that chest. Keep it going, guys. Taking the bottom leg down if you need. You're almost there, not giving in. Keep going, take the bar out if you need. Last 10. Keep going, keep going. You're almost to that cool down. And time. Whew. Awesome job, guys. You survived it. Grab some water. Change our time real quick. All right. I want you to stay down on the ground on those knees. Walk your hands out in front, reaching back into that child pose. Press down on those shoulders, up and up those knees. Big deep breath. Get a good stretch on those shoulders. Take the right arm underneath the left. Press that hand up towards that shoulder. Switch them. Left goes under the right. Great job today. Thanks so much for hitting play and joining me. Come back to that child pose to the center. We're gonna go all the way through. Stretch that stomach out, looking up at the ceiling. Stretch that core, you just worked it pretty dang good. Drop it to those knees. We're gonna spin around onto our butts, bringing the heels together, pull it in close, elbows to those knees, chest up tall, open up the flexors. Hopefully you enjoyed that one. Trying to keep it a little different. Keep it interesting for you guys, using stuff you might have around the house. Release it, release it, grab those toes, bring that chest towards the heels, keep it up tall. Release that, take the heels straight out front. Big deep breath in. Extend up onto those toes and hold it there. Grabbing the shins if you need. Try to get a little deeper. Roll it in nice and slow. One more. Reach out. Holding it there. Release it. Take the right arm across. Switch those arms. Elbow up and over. Switch them. Out. 
Take it down, one big deep breath in. Release it. Thanks again for joining guys. Appreciate all of you who subscribed and keep watching. I'll keep making them for you. Um, hope to see you guys soon and have a great day. Hope you're enjoying the workouts.